This is Sneaker Gears, my name is Levi. Today we have another performance quick take on energy return cushioning. So what that means is, is a shoe that's gonna give back as much as you're putting in. So two shoes that really come to mind or two types of cushionings are Nike Zoom or Zoom Max and Adidas's Boost. So to showcase how it feels, if you look at the Zoom Max, and I have some KD Elites on, they feel like a freaking trampoline. <laughs> so, really similar. This is what it feels like when you're running down the court. So you're trying to do the running man. Now, if I, the higher I try to jump, you're gonna notice there's a lag. There is that lag for that energy return. So if you're trying to be the fastest, it's not gonna quite be there because you don't have the responsiveness as much there. And that's where boost comes in, where you have energy return with responsiveness. Let me showcase that like this. So if you take a, a trampoline and put something solid below it, I'm losing that base, but I'm able to get a lot higher. So that's kind of what boost feels like, where it gives you a little bit of stability underneath, where you feel the ground, you still have that energy return, so it feels amazing on your joints. Having some kind of energy return is probably the most popular kind of cushioning. They just added it in the Saucony line. It's a reason Boost has been amazing, and it's a reason Nike's Zoom is such a popular cushioning in the market. So combining that with something that's a little plush, kind of like Lunar, where it has a little bit of energy return, or combining that with responsiveness, which is what a little bit of Boost gives you, is an awesome compromise. Energy return cushioning is best used in the Zoom Max, which literally feels like a trampoline. So obviously you're gonna have that little bit of hesitation where you're not gonna be as explosive But that's where obviously you have that blend coming in where you have something like the ultra boost Which gives you a bounce energy return, but it does have some response and that's the end of it So you're able to push off now it have energy return with kind of a plush feel I feel the Vimero does a great job. This is kind of Nike's lunar. This also has small zoom cuts so this kind of gives you an idea. Again, you're always gonna have a combination of two of those three levels with their biasness being towards one. Now Nike will have a runner called the Zoom All Out that is gonna be a Zoom Max running shoe, not just for basketball. Hopefully this guys helps you out. Please let us know if you guys have any questions. This is Sneaker Gears and we'll come at you later.